Caesars Entertainment is one David Tepper stock down 63% that I think you might regret not buying on this dip here. Of course, David, David Tepper is a portfolio manager of uh, Appaloosa Management, which has over $1.3 billion under management as of February 14, 2023. And Caesars Entertainment is one of the holdings in his portfolio at 1.31% of the overall portfolio. Uh, overall, uh, he's got 24 stocks in the portfolio. So have, entering one out of those 24 is not an easy feat. So Caesars Entertainment must have some excellent qualities that David Tepper is attracted to. And so I'll talk about why I think Caesars Entertainment is an excellent David Tepper stock to buy on the dip here. Starting with revenue, of course, Caesars Entertainment is a, a owner operator of casinos in the Las Vegas Strip and regional areas, as well as an online sports book that is doing really well. The company expects that segment to generate $500 million in adjusted EBITDA profits in 2025. So the company's uh, generating revenue from both sides of the entertainment segment. And of course, uh, the Las Vegas and regional casinos were devastated by the COVID-19 pandemic, as you could see in its operating profit margin, which collapsed in 2020 at, in the aftermath of the COVID-19 pandemic when it was forced to shut its doors temporarily. However, the company is bouncing its profitability back, uh, ending its most recent update at 17.2%. And before the outbreak, it was on an upward trend as the company had um, migrated away from generating profits in gaming to generating profits from higher room rates, from higher entertainment prices, food, entertainment, shopping, all of that. Uh, casinos have started to generate more revenue and profits from those segment and uh, less focus on gaming revenue, which can be more cyclical and more uh, dependent on high rollers, which may or may not come to your casino. So all in all, this casino is in, or this entertainment company is in better shape than before the outbreak. And still consumers are um, showing a greater appetite for activities away from home. And one of the beneficiaries are entertainment companies like Caesars Entertainment, where people can just get out of their home, go somewhere else, have some fun and, and, really just make up for all that lost time when we were cooped up indoors and Caesars Entertainment is really in a good position to benefit from that it's already benefiting from it and um, it it is likely to persist this isn't going to end in the next uh, month or two right people are still unleashing that pent-up demand that's likely to persist for the rest of 2023 and the company is likely to benefit from that and remember it has raised room rates it's raised its room prices it's raised entertainment prices it's raised food prices all of, all of that is increasing the profit margin because um most of its costs are fixed, right? Uh, to operate that casino, it's already spent the money to build up those casinos. That's not cash that needs to go out any longer. So now these uh, the incremental increases in room prices are just nice additions to the bottom line because those rooms, it's not like they're upgrading, spending a lot of money upgrading those rooms. They're just saying, hey, you know what? Inflation, inflation, everybody. So we got to raise prices. So here's a room that used to cost $200 a night. We're going to make it $245 a night. Uh, take it or leave it. If you don't want it, there's somebody else that, that is paying for it as you could, as evidenced by the elevated profit margins. So um, I think these are all good signs for investors. And uh, another reason why I think this is one David Tepper stock that investors might regret not buying on the dip. I want to thank The Motley Fool for sponsoring this video. Visit fool.com slash parkev for the 10 best stocks to buy now.
And the final reason why I'll give why this is a David Tepper stock investors will want to consider is the reasonable valuation. Caesars Entertainment is trading at a forward price to earnings of 18.51. That's the lowest this stock has traded for going back a year and a half. So you haven't had an opportunity to buy this stock at a lower valuation than you've had in the last year and a half. And that's due to this 63% decline in the stock price. Um, some of this is due to fears of an economic recession oncoming, right? If there is a recession, you have to figure that one of the things that people might cut back on is visiting casinos, right? If you lose your job, you're less likely to book a trip to a Vegas casino. Although offsetting that could be that, you know, pent up demand from consumers. So uh, it might not like be like any other recession before where, uh, you know, economic recession typically leads to a decrease in, in Las Vegas revenues and, and entertainment companies like Caesars Entertainment. It might be different this time because of that pent up consumer demand right for the last two years one of the things that was severely absent from consumer budgets was on travel and entertainment spending outside of the home so even if there's a recession this might be one area where people do not cut back spending on all that much all that much that now that's that remains to be seen but there is the potential for this recession to be a little bit different than recessions in the past. All right, so that's all I've got. Those are all the reasons why I think Caesars Entertainment is one David Tepper stock. You might regret not buying on this dip here. All right, thank you so much for watching. I hope you'll tune in again next time. And I've picked out this video for you right here, I think. Yeah, that's popping up on your screen. I think you're going to enjoy that. So please click on that video and I'll see you over there. Thank you so much for watching.